Hello, welcome to Do It Yourself with Wayne. Today we're doing a tool review on this Irwin Vice Grip Fencing Pliers. Um, I just recently purchased this uh, from one of the big box hardware stores. Uh, I had a pair of these some years ago. It was a cheaper version or a did cheaper company, but uh, they served me well, but somewhere along the line I lost them. And uh, so I bought a good quality brand name. Irwin makes a good tool. Doesn't matter what it is they make. They're, they're, they're good tools. And I uh, just want to go over some of the features of these things and what you can use them for. Uh, as the name implies, these are fencing tools and that's mainly what it's designed for. There's a lot of features here. If you see the little notches here, they're on both sides. That's for cutting your fencing wire. Uh, typically you may have electric fence like this. It'll cut that no problem. It's really easy. If you've got heavier gauge wire, like this stuff, it just cuts right through it. Um, if you're using the hog wire or uh, something of that nature, the dog lot wire, it's no problem cutting that wire with these pliers. I've done it many times over the years, and they've, they've worked really well. Uh, back here in the back of the handle, you've got grips here. And here, or if you need to crimp down on something, you can do that. It works well for that. You've also got grips up here in the top, different sizes. If you need to grab a small nut or bolt or something to turn it, do whatever, works well for that. Um, you got a hammer head here. If you need to drive nails in, works good for that. If you need to pull them out, you can do that and get them out. It's not quite like a hammer with a, a claw hammer, but it works well. Now if you got staples like this for your fencing, and believe me, I've driven a lot of these things in fence posts before. Um, if you get that in your fence post and you decide it's not the right thing, you got this neat little point here. That little point will reach in there, and you may have to work at it a little bit. Obviously I didn't hammer that in very far. But that little point's great for pulling those nails or those staples out. Another thing you'll find it handy for, I bought this pair, uh, I don't do a lot of fencing anymore, but I got a small John Deere tractor, and I'm going to put this in the toolbox on the tractor. Because uh, when you're out and about, you, you know, you're using your tractor, it seems like there's always something that you need to, to hammer on or beat on or twist or turn or something. But uh, one thing you'll have... Um, now this pin was out of the uh, trailer hitch on my truck, but pins like this are very common in farm implements and things, uh, particularly on my box blade. I got these for the rippers, and sometimes you need to pull this pin out to get the, the uh, adjust the rippers for different depth, depths, either up or down. And sometimes, you know, where this clamp or this uh, pin seems to be is hard to get to. You can take this little point right there and makes it easier to because you got something you can grab onto this thing with to make it easier to pull out. So there's a lot of useful things for these pliers, uh, particularly if you got a you know some fencing or a farm or anything. Uh, like I said, I bought this pair to put this toolbox that's on my tractor because when you're out using your tractor, it seems like there's always something you need a pair of pliers or a little hammer or something. Uh, so I just think it's a very good cost-effective thing to have in your toolbox on your tractor. And they're great to have just in your toolbox as well. It's a very versatile tool. Uh, so I do recommend them. I think this is a great quality tool. So, um, you know, if you need something like this, if you've got a need for it, I do recommend this Irwin uh, fencing plier. And uh, if you like our video, I'd really appreciate it if you click like on it and subscribe to our channel. It's viewers like you that help us to grow this channel and provide more videos to help you save money. And that's what this channel is all about, is helping you save money. Thank you for visiting. We hope you have a great day.